Hi guys, this is Ratchet Throw, and I'm not gonna do any introducing anymore. So let's uh, lock the chapter two. And FBI is here to arrest Marina. And is it because uh, there's something you could do right now? FBI, put your hands in the air. Marina Romano, you're under arrest. What? Why? You're not sure about what's done, which makes you her accomplice in the present kidnapping. But just because she's her daughter doesn't mean she's a, an accomplice. That's preposterous. Maria is loyal to the Barrio. She helped us arrest her mother last time. We got our orders, ma'am. How dare you touch her? Maria was with me the whole day. She can't have kidnapped anyone. Lower your gun or you'll be arrested next, Mr. Karen. I don't care. Arrest me, but you're not taking Marina. Jonah, no, you can't help me if you're also in prison. Listen to her, Jonah. Marina, I, I'll i get you out of there. I love you. I know. Come along, Mr. Obadova. Jesus Christ. Alright, so much of getting some help from Marina. She's not gonna help us in this case. Wow. Why did you stop me from breaking those agents' faces, Carmen? I could have busted Marina out. And then what? You go on the run? This situation won't be resolved with fists. We need to talk to some in a position of authority. What about the vice president? We met her back in San Francisco and she seemed reasonable. She might see us now. Good idea, but I wanted to keep an eye on Jonah. I'm afraid we'll do something stupid like storm a federal prison by himself. I'll come with you, Katia. Let's hope the vice president will listen to us and free Marina. Okay then. Just because uh, she's Natasha's daughter doesn't mean... Uh, She's an accomplice. Wow. How could you be so stupid? Madam Vice President, our colleague has nothing to do with the President's kidnapping. I understand that you'd like to think so, but yeah, but Mr. Badawa is too suspicious given her mother's involvement. I was like, oh, this Russia's got past our defenses. Man, Russia isn't behind this. President Hewitt was kidnapped by an international criminal organization called Sambra. Please don't insult my intelligence. I know that Sambra doesn't exist. It exists, and how many times did I try to prove this and you didn't listen? Wow. I started my career in the CIA, back to the military trade. We were told about an enemy so secret all files of them were classified. But as I climbed the ranks, I learned the truth. Summer was a made up threat, an excuse for us to operate in various foreign countries. Secretary, so if you meant to vouch for your colleague by invoking this old life, please don't bother. Ma'am, sorry to throw, we just found a van Romano used to transport the president after kidnapping him. Ace GPS coordinates let us know where she took you, to the cloisters. There could have been a better place for this debriefing, but thank you, Agent Rear Dan. Ma'am, we'll take our leave. We need to get to the cloisters, the president could still be there. Ooh, let's do it. Oh, we gotta find him now. Is this a new crime scene? Please let it be. Come on, come on. Load! He's not there. Well, shit. Nothing then. No time we're gonna rescue him in the chapter 3 when we arrest the killer, right? Look at all that blood, Katia. Could this be where Ratsha was killed? Or do you think it's the president's? Who the victim the killer must have worn these clothes? Let's take a sample of blood from them, quick. And a hero in that prayer book could give us a lead on what happened here. Let's collect it. Katia, yeah, that shot took the president to this place, but what happened after remains a mystery. The future of this country depends on us solving it. That's right. Alright, first this prayer book. Yeah, let's put the hair for the book under the microscope. Okay. Alright, now this bloody glows.
still a set of blood for the girls to lost. We need to know who was murdered here. Alright. Don't let it be president. Just let it be Natasha. Alright, 12 hours. Alright, now let's now analyze this hair. Whose hair is this? Baxter again. The hair for the fucking fire at the closest belongs to Baxter. This means he had to be involved in a kidnapping. I knew it. So much for leaving someone behind and using his powers for good. Good thing Baxter's already up holding cells. Yeah, let him try to whistle out now. Alright. Alright, Baxter, you're becoming too suspicious. Bastard gave us out. We found your DNA at the cloisters. We know you helped that Shakir out the president. You you approve I was there? That's a bad, but I don't can't What's wrong with you? Nothing's wrong. I maybe overdose on sleepy pills. How to judge the dosage with my super fast metabolism. Just don't ask me anything, I beg you, I can't talk with Spectia. You have no choice. What happened at the cloister? Is the president still alive? This isn't military training anymore, you can't give me orders. My head, it's killing me. Just leave me alone. Katia, I can't believe it. We finally have a soil leader, we can't get anything out of him. I wish Marina was here. We just have to dig up the truth some other way. Bastard, if you're faking this fit, you'll live to regret it. Jesus, dude. Is this another side effect you're getting from being experimented on? Except for just... Yellow eyes. Craziness now comes. We'll see. Let's check out this blood. There, I can't believe the FBI arrested Marina. I know, bro. I thought Jura was going to murder someone. But speaking of murder, whose blood was it on the gloves? Goodness, Katia, the blood wasn't the president's. Well, I knew it was going to be that. Pew! So maybe someone hasn't killed him yet. Yet, being the worry part of that sentence. But yes, the blood matched Natasha's. See, she's the one who was killed at the cloisters. She must have brought the president there. Then her accomplice murdered her and moved the body of the president elsewhere. But how do we find them? Despite help, your blood sample was contaminated by trace of other heights, esters, and phenolic compounds indicating of whiskey. This trace should have come from the body itself, so they must have been on the killer's clothes. Which means our killer drinks whiskey. They also give them a reason to drown their sorrows. Okay. Yeah, I hate that Saur accused him one step ahead of us. We know where Natasha took the present, but he's no longer there. And we must find him before the king comes to harm. With everyone blaming Russia for the kidnapping, we might get the declarations of war if he turns up dead. Who cares about politics? You need to prove Marina innocent. Cool, Jonah, we're on it. Let's think. We know the president's kidnapper killed Natasha at the closest and then dumped her body at Times Square. Somewhere along the line, they must have made mistakes. Let's cop Times Square again. Okay. All right, let's let's investigate the terrace. So we got four familiar faces of suspects and one guy we don't know. We didn't know from before, so but Carmen did. But that is a suspect. Newspaper. Whatever this super newspaper article says is clearly about the president. Dusty will reveal the text. A photo on this talent must have been taken about the time Natasha's body was dropped here, judging by the people panicking. You're right, the woman in the foreground looks like she's tried hard to pass by unnoticed. Her face is too blurry to make out. I say we look this woman up in the database. Let's go, Katia. There's not a moment to lose. Okay. Alright, first this newspaper. Let's 
Seriously? Arabic? Come on. I didn't expect this newspaper to be in Arab Arabic. It must be a na I mean, international edition or something. We got to know what it says about the president. Let's get the article to the pot. Who would write it on Arabic? Seriously? 12 hours. Alright, let's look this woman up. She's actually back. What? No! Did a woman in this photo can't be Angela? How did she want to get out of jail? She's supposed to rot in there for betraying us. Hasn't she already done enough to mess with us and break Lars's heart? Did she help kidnap the president too? Katria, Angela, she's. Yes, we know, she broke out of jail. No, you don't understand. Angela's here. What do you want? Why did you come here to us if. Hold on. How many suspects do we have? Wait, you gotta have, have more than five suspects? We got six of them so far. Alright, you keep me excited. Why are you here and how did you get out of jail? Put your hands up, Angela. It's good to see you too, Katria. Would you have a glass of whiskey with me for old ties' sake? No! You have some god bringing up the old ties. What are you doing here? How did you break out of jail? Someone broke me out, of course. They said they had plans for me. But all I care about was, get, was seeing my girls again. Are they here? No, they are. If you came here hoping to pop back into their and lost lives, think again. Just us. What part did you play in the president's kidnapping and not just murder? No part at all. Someone just told me to be on standby. I knew the risks when I came here, Katia. I knew you'd arrest me. Frankly, if I had can't see my family, I don't care what happens to me. Stop this... This emotional manipulation won't work. We're still locking you up, and we'll be keeping a close eye on you. It better be, I don't want her to get out again. Jack, Tia, is it true? Is Angela black back? Yes, yeah, she walked right in, didn't even try to hide. I can't believe this. Bro, you gotta be okay? I'm not about to do anything stupid out of despair, if that's what you're asking. I just betrayal broke my heart, but I walked a long road since then. Not the same person that I know she was never the person I believed her to be. Honestly, though, I'd rather not see her if you don't mind, Katria. I'm just going to go out, clear my head for a little while. Of course, bro, you gotta take care of yourself. Katria, if Angela messes with Lars' head again, I. I don't know what I'll do. Don't kill her, just don't kill her, don't turn out to be murderer, too. Let's check out this ceramic test, and are we gonna get another new suspect? Because we seem to have, we seem that we are going to have more than five suspects. We already have the six suspects and suspect, and that's jealous. So, must have means the New York clothes are fascinating, despite all the blood. So much history in one place. Boy, what the heck? What side secret or crime scene? And fate, I visited the closest, looking for a secret passage or a hidden room where the prisoner might be kept. But I found nothing. He's out there. I pray he isn't dead. Only by rescue he can we prove our colleague doesn't know he's kidnapping. Every fourth war between the US and Russia. Oh, then, uh, what, what did that newspaper article say about the president? A sad story. The article talked about a recent US airstrike on the town of Arazir. A president of president ordered the strike despite his general's advice. And many civilians died, including the family of UN High Commissioner Leila Malak. Oh, that's not gonna be good at all. What president is responsible for the death of Leila Malak's family? That's one heck of a reason to want revenge. You can't forget that Miss Malak is the one who arranged the meeting between Natasha and the president. She definitely owes us answers. Ooh, that's gonna make that that probably made her really angry. Miss Malak, I could tell us what happened to your family due to the president's orders, but you shouldn't mention this to us earlier. So you found out about the airstrikes, Verkatia? I hope you were. It's irrelevant to your investigation. With all the respect, excuse your ability to want the president gone. Whatever you assume, my grief is by yours, Verkatia. I won't account to you for my nightmares or for the sleepy pills I'm taking to cope. 
Your records will show you how I react to the airstrike. I brought it up to be discussed at the general assembly as per procedure. Of course, the bureaucratic process, process security in our organization make it difficult to resolve such crises quickly. Difficult enough that you take advantage of your own hands? No, it's because I don't believe in prior vengeance. I work for peace. And I work to learn the truth behind the president's kidnapping, so you'd better not be lying to us, Miss Malak. Yeah, alright, I'm sleeping pills, so you're out. Katia, yeah, I want to believe that the president is still alive, but El Ray's plan was to kill him, so the more time passed, the sliver the hope. I know some people are saying that the country is better off without him after all the controversial decisions he's made. But only finding him will stop the conflict between the US and Russia from escalating. Only by finding him can we prove Maria's innocence. We know Maria's mom took the president to the cloisters after she kidnapped him. At the cloisters, her accomplice killed her and then took the president somewhere else. If we knew who her killer is, we'd know where the president is right now. Someone who knows more than he's telling his backstory. He was at the cloisters, so he must be involved. But without Maria here, we can't make it talk. And don't give me started on Jella, who just turned up at the Bereau. Run! What is it? I don't get her, at this. Like she wanted to get arrested. Wait, did you hear it? Someone just shot at us to run? What's going on? Boom! What? 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 What happened? What? What? Alright. We gotta stop here. You gotta continue playing Chapter 3. So, thank you for watching. Look at you like this video. I'll see you again. Goodbye! Yeah.